to the channel today is day three of my comfy cozy christmas and i am just laying out all the decorations that i picked up in the previous videos haul shop with me listen i have to lay out everything to make sure i know exactly the game plan that i'm going to tackle this tree with this is my first year using picks and i'm excited about it i'm a little nervous because i've never used it i picked up these ball ones from michael's i thought they were cute but these are all the decorations that i'm going to be using and it's going to be my first time also using deco mesh and i'm really excited because this one is beautiful look at that royal blue color it's absolutely stunning so i was like okay i want to go in that loop and tuck type of style i really liked that so i just went straight down the tree um i might do like a diagonal next year to try it out but this is my first time like i said and i was like i have no clue what i'm doing i just know that this deco mesh is really pretty and i want it on my trees so i was like let me get to work halfway down on the other side when I realized that I ran out of deco mesh I was kind of disappointed in myself for only getting one roll I can't believe I only got one roll of this thinking there would be enough but it wasn't so I ran out of deco mesh and so what I decided to do is just focus on the other parts of the tree that I could so I just tucked in all of my larger silver balls more towards the bottom of the tree because that's where the most of the volume was so that's where I wanted the bigger Christmas balls to be so then I added in this silver deco mesh I really like this one because it has this net detail and it's really stretchy and the net can expand and open up so I thought that was a really beautiful detail and it allowed me to cover a larger surface area once I was done with that deco mesh, I just went in and hung a couple more balls just in spaces that I know that when I get in the new deco mesh, it won't be bothered, but I just wanted to get up a few of these balls. And then I went to work on my tree topper. Again, my first year working with pigs, really excited about it. I think this came out really good. It allowed me to really see where I wanted everything to go, how high I wanted it. I love the fact that they added some volume at the top of the tree, some drama, and these picks weren't exactly silver. They had some hints of blue and teal, and I thought that was really pretty. Now, in one of the sets, they had these dark navy blue and silver snowflakes. Very, very beautiful, very light, and a little way to add something else to the tree. So I just added these everywhere I could. So so it's the next morning and I went out and got some more of that gorgeous royal blue deco mesh and I stuffed it into the areas that was left over so mostly towards the bottom of the tree I did three sides of the tree and then the last thing I added was this gorgeous tree skirt from Michaels it's a cream color with that silver trimming at the bottom I thought it added just a little bit of glamour to the tree so I really like how that turned out at the base beautiful beautiful tree skirt but i want to show you my final look of my tree i'm walking around feeling free thinking about what's happened to me from july up till now don't know where don't know how lately i've come to realize that i can't see it in your eyes so it's true i'm so glad you feel it too this is my tree guys i'm super duper proud of it i really really love it let me know down in the comment section what you guys think and i can't wait to see you in the next video
summer ended, but we did not. We started.